ever since the emergence of music as a foremost means of prime entertainment and a huge money-making venture, record labels have played a critical role in housing, grooming and propelling artists to stardom. Welcome to Tuna Chiki and in today's video, we will look at the top 10 richest and biggest recording labels in Africa. Before we get into the video, remember to subscribe and ring the notification bell so that you don't miss out on any of our videos. Number 10. Love World Records, net worth 8 million US dollars. The only gospel record label on the list and a religious subsidiary of Believers Love World, aka Christ Embassy, was founded in 2009. The label, since its entrance into prominence, promoted a sparring and top gospel act in Nigeria. The likes of Frank Edward, Butchie, Ehi, Sinaj, Joe Praise, Chris Shalom, Eben, Ada, and most household names when it comes to gospel music in Nigeria owe a heartfelt homage to Love World Records. Number 9. Capitol Hill Records, net worth 9.5 million US dollars. Owned by renowned producer Clarence Peters, son of famous Nigerian music legend Shina Peters and veteran actress Clarion Chukura, the record label has been around for a while and has earned itself a solid reputation amongst record labels in Nigeria owing to the amazing producing skills of its CEO. It once had signed Chidema, The Suspect and rapper Kel, but in time the artist went on to be signed in other labels. Number 8. Xylophone Media, net worth 10 million US dollars. Xylophone Media is one of the most popular record labels in Ghana at the moment. This record label rose to limelight when the dancehall king Shutter was signed. Prior to that, they had a deal with Stoneboy, which lasted for about two years. Currently, Xylophone invests in budding artists with promising futures and great talent. Other artists currently signed onto Xylophone Media include Tisha, Kumi Guitar, Obibini, and several others. Number 7. EME Records, net worth 11 million US dollars. Empire Mates Entertainment was founded in 2002 by Nigerian popular R&B singer Banky W while in Albany, New York. EME would later wake up to see itself in Lagos, Nigeria when its founder relocated back home to promote African music talents. One of the most famous and breakout stars from the label was Wizkid, who was groomed from the street by Banky, his potentials harnessed to the max and today he's been booked four years up front. Number 6. Chocolate City Music, net worth 14.5 million US dollars. Founded in 2005 as a subsidiary of Chocolate City Group by lawyer Audu Maikori, alongside Paul Okeugo and Yahaya Maikori, the music empire is certainly a force to reckon with in the Nigerian music industry. The label is unique with its crop of talented urban rappers in the likes of M.I., Ice Prince, Jesse Jags, Nosa, Femi Kuti, Price, and its sensational first lady Victoria Kimani from Kenya. Number 5. Super Black Tapes, net worth 16 million US dollars. Home to the new generation of deep African house for artists like T Scissor, Fred Buddha, and Offuren. Focusing on releasing music solely for African artists, Super Black has been around for over five years and was originally called Roots Go Deep Music before transforming to Super Black Tapes in 2016. Number 4. Starboy Entertainment, net worth 22 million US dollars. After bidding EME Records farewell to lead a solo progressive career, in 2019, Nigerian A list music act Whiskey launched his label imprint, The Starboy Entertainment. According to Whiskey, he established his own record label to give upcoming musicians a chance at success. His record label is one with a glaring identity in the Nigerian music scene with acts like Malik, Berry, Legendary Beats, LAX, Effia, R2Bs, and Mr. Easy. Number 3. Gallo Records, net worth 37 million US dollars. They are actually the largest record label in South Africa who broke influential groups like Lady Smith Black Mambaso, who had the first release by a black musician in apartheid South Africa to reach gold status. 
It was also home to the late Lucky Dube, South Africa's biggest selling reggae artist and political activist whose classics like I Am a Prisoner shone light on the brutal regime during the apartheid. Number 2. Davido Music Worldwide, DMW, net worth 40 million US dollars. Davido was once a member of the HKN gang, a label that seemed more like a family business co-owned by Davido's father, himself and his brother. His cousins B-Red and Shina Rambo were his first official signees. He however left the record to establish his own, hence the Davido Music Worldwide Entertainment outfit. Currently, he has Dremo and the popular Mama Kruna signed onto his record label. DMW stands as one of the biggest and hottest record labels in the country at the moment. And the number one richest and biggest recording label in Africa goes to Marvin Records, aka Marvin Dynasty, net worth 45 million US dollars. Founded by Michael Collins Ajere, popularly known as Don Jersey in 2012, following a split with his former co-partner Debanj, the Marvin's Dynasty is the biggest and most influential record label in Nigeria and arguably West Africa. It houses top artists like Ricardo Banks, The Prince, Dr. Sid, Corrado Bello, Dija, Tiwa Savage, Rema and Aya Star. On 8th May 2012, the label released its compilation album Solar Plexus. In January 2019, Marvin Records secured a multi-million dollar investment from Kupanda Holdings, a subsidiary of Kupanda Capital and TPG Growth. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe, follow, share and like our video. It's the best way of supporting us. And remember, Africa is watching.